Said y'all like the first one. I thought I hit y'all with a second one. Poetic Flacco, you gonna take the lead. Let's see what we got here. Freddie Gibbs. Fred I don't know what they call you. I don't know if I should like you, but we gonna watch a video right now. This beef with Benny the Butcher got Freddie Gibbs taking L's right and left. Like, bro can't stop taking L's. What Benny the Butcher is doing to Freddie Gibbs should be illegal. And it's even more impressive because Ben the Butcher is on a 0350 run in terms of beef, and they both washed up rappers. He's making Freddie Gibbs even more irrelevant than Freddie Gibbs already is, and to me, that's an impressive feat. If you Dinosaur guys don't know what's going what is he on with Freddie Gibbs and Ben the Butcher, let me give you guys a backstory. See, Freddie Gibbs made fun of Ben the Butcher getting shot in Houston. <gasps> Baby, get some other medication for you. Me. Have a man ass some attack. The wrong one. Oh, sh What's that? Two good feet still working. Hey, I might run. I might run them out. Oh, sh see my not foot. good to do that. Oh, see, see, it's not good to do that, that kids. Pay attention. It's Can not good to do that. that. You, Can you get, it on you get foot? bad results. You know, when Freddie Gibbs went to Buffalo, New York for a show, which just happened to be Don't Benny do the drugs. Butcher's just, hometown, uh, Freddie CBD. Gibbs got the living ish beaten out of him. Got his chain snatched. Got his girl chain snatched and got her beaten up too. Nothing exciting. I was cleaning my jewels. CBD. Hey, yo, MC Dinosaur Barbecue. That's what got your head punched in the first time. Talk about shit. Fucks with Benny the Butcher, it. man. I, I don't really like Freddie Gibbs. Dragged you by your chain. Dragged you by your. Took this off your back. You. MC Dinosaur Barbecue. You've been getting ran down on by for the past year. But how the gun. Ran down on. You that a gun. Dinosaur barbecue. It's punched your head all in. Had you fucking lumped up stitches all in your Get a Gatorade. For They're running delicious. your mouth like you're doing now. Remember that? Now the spanking. The whole fucking thing of tape. His goons gave to Freddie Gibbs and his girlfriend was so profound and immense that after the spanking. It was his career ending. Didn't respect him anymore. And she made that very clear in her interview with academics. Slowly Didn't she do porno with like fall, alien, like, alien baby, got, baby yeah, alien? And I saw like how that affected Didn't you him. see that? I saw, you know, how, and he even made a comment to me. She looks like, like a little baby giraffe, right? I thought you don't respect me after yeah. what happened in Buffalo, you know? And I'm like, well, I kind of did lose respect for you because now I see that I, I'm not protected. Like you always said I would, you know what I mean? So, but oh my God, sense. so you're you just going to start shit and then he's just I mean, supposed he to protect you. I don't know. I'm not going to speak anything. He says VL. Well, that's the thing, and, and whenever he would, like, rep his set and, like, oh, I'm VL, whatever, it, it would make me feel like, okay, he knows people that know people that know people that can protect me, right? And I always felt protected around him and his friends. It's and then usually when I never like that, that ma'am. It's really usually like never, that, nine times out of ten, like, it's, oh, it's shit, never really like, like that. What, what's going on? This person is not who he says he uh, is. You so got duped. It's the fucking the rap game. Welcome. Mommy, and she got her chain snatch as well. Now, she said that she thought Freddie Gibbs was Ooh. the biggest, baddest, toughest <laughs> gangster on earth, that he was a big vice lord, so she never expected him to get whooped on and spanked in that manner by another rapper in his entourage. So she and then talk shot. about that, that booty shit he was talking about. That's kind of... Pause, pause, pause. The spanking that Benny the Butcher gave this man caused his whole relationship to end and then afterwards, his baby mama did a tell-all interview with Freddie Gibbs' number two op, DJ Academics, pretty much exposing him. She would tell a story of how Freddie Gibbs was spread open his butthole for her to see on multiple occasions, which is a very no. str strange thing coming from a gangster rapper. No, dude. And I'll tell you the setting. We were on FaceTime. No. And he just bent over in the camera and just spread that shit wide open. Sorry, I got to end it short. How many minutes? Wait, he was naked? short one, bro. Yeah. He was naked? I can't do that. He was butt naked. I don't know why he did it. We were about to hang up. Like.